did watch last night, so I'm waking up pretty late. I have a late clock in, which is 10 a.m. And I have to cook Lingmi breakfast to the side, so I'm going to eat breakfast. Then chill in for 30 minutes. And then go check in with we'll Rosé. Being on Sea Watch, it is always hard adjusting to a new schedule and getting adjusted to new sleep patterns. But it's also fun because you learn a lot of things on the bridge. So here's a full day of me on Sea Watch and day work. tripping i was just tired and just seeing stuff but i swear i seen the shooting star last night <laughs> and nobody told me the rules about how many wishes you get when you see a shooting star so i said three little wishes and one of them that it come true eventually i don't care if it's two years from now five years <laughs> but y'all i really seen the shooting star you know how you see something and you look to see if anybody else seen it like i know i seen the shooting star anyways it's lunchtime. i just ate and i'm gonna take a nap but i feel terrible like i don't know if it's the combination of the caffeine wearing down because i finally had coffee for the first time ever last night doing sea watch and me being seasick so i don't know but i'm gonna lay down hopefully i feel better after this nap and be ready for our safety meeting so yeah you wanna hear the shit it's rolling, it's rolling, it's rolling, it's rolling. I'm so tired, y'all. I gotta go all the way up to get some air plugs so I can check this rest. These stairs are killing me. Last night on Sea Watch, we're almost there. 